सो ही गाइज वेलकम टू द न्यू वीडियो टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी दैट हाउ कैन यू क्रिएट अ बेसिक लॉग इन सिस्टम इन पाइथन एंड वी विल इंटरेक्ट विद दैट लॉग इन सिस्टम यूजिंग आवर कंजूल दैट इज आवर टर्मिनल सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द वीडियो फर्स्टली ओपन योर वी एस कोड एंड ओपन योर रिक्वायर्ड फोल्डर जस्ट गो इन फाइल टैब एंड देन ओपन फोल्डर एंड सिलेक्ट योर रिक्वायर्ड फोल्डर Now I will create a file named as main dot py. Now, what you have to do is you have to import two built-in libraries. One is our OS, import OS, and other one is import hashlib. Import hashlib. This will be used for hashing our passwords. Okay, now you have to create a user file. user file equals users dot txt we will be uh, we will be storing all the you can say data of passwords and usernames in this particular file okay now what you have to do is we have to create a main function firstly def main and in brackets okay main function start we have to give some options in the terminal firstly options will be options equals this will be in a dictionary options equals uh one will be the key and the value for that will be register okay then what you have to do is we have to create this one second option will be our login and third will be our exit third will be our exit so what you have to do is while true print this particular thing backslash in backslash in and then first option will be our register then line change second option will be login then line change third option will be exit okay that's it now we have to give some logic here firstly we have to get the choice of the user choice equals choice equals input we have to take this as the input and then option choose an option this will be in quotations that is a string value colon and then just now you have to get the action of this action equals options dot get and then we have to uh, get the value of choice okay then what you have to do is if action if action contains some value then just simply call this else else for this 
print and valid option. Then we have to create some required functions here. Firstly, we will create a hash password function. Def hash password. Hash password. This will be a function that contains some password and create a hash for that. Return. return hash lib dot sha256 password dot encode password dot encode dot hexadigest this will convert into hexadecimal numbers and then just you have to create a new function for checking if the user exists user exists you will pass username here then what you have to do is if not os dot path dot exist we have to check for the file here firstly user file this one then what you have to do is return false return false with then you have to open your file with open user file in read mode in read mode as if return any line starts with then we have to check for return if user exists then we have to return any line that starts with username it starts with then again a bracket and then if a string value inside that inside that we will pass username username colon brackets closed here okay and then for line in f so this is done now we have to create a register and a login function for that what you have to do is just go here and then create a register function username equals we have to input a username as a string value enter user name okay then if user exists we have to call this function this particular one if user exists this particular function you have to pass the username here and then print user already exists if user exists Okay, this part is almost done. It 
remove this and then just simply return return the thing okay then what you have to do is we have to input the password for then password equals input enter a new password then you have to open your user.txt with open user file in write mode in append mode user file in append mode as f f dot write f then in again in strings we have to pass the username and then we have to pass the hash to password of that for that colon and then you have to create call the hash pa hash password function this one and then hash password with this password value okay then just simply close this one backslash n for line change okay so we are done with this function just simply type registration successful registration successful def login if not we have to check for that user's file exists or not OS dot path dot exists a user file with open user file Okay, then what you have to do is use the file as f, then colon. We have to open this file in read mode. Yeah, read mode. Okay, we can do one thing firstly. We have to write the if condition for this firstly. If you just have to print a that print no users registered. Registered. Okay, then what you have to do is just simply complete this one before that we can take username as input username equals input enter username then password equals input enter password Okay then we are almost done. We have to create the hash for this. Hash equals hash password. We have to pass the ha password here. 
okay then let's complete our this function this particular line that is for line in f we have to check for lines now for line in f if line dot strip this is a function for file handling you can see we have to check that if this matches with the current credentials or not f then in again strings you have to pass the username and hashed password here username and then hashed password here hashed this one now what you have to do is you just have to if these are equal then you have to say that firstly a colon print login successful login successful ok then if not then you have to say login credentials incorrect or you can say login field print login field ok now, uh, now let's try running our program firstly we have to save this formatting is done automatically ok uh, in the end we have to call this main function because we have created a main function if name underscore underscore this one double equals main this one then what you have to do is you have to call the main function just save this now let's try rerunning re our program ok this one we have just some indentation or like this one this one here slash in ok now it will look more cleaner firstly we have to exit this now rerun our program ok so now you can create a user firstly first option username will be pratham and password will be 0101 now i have to log in this one then you can just simply enter your username and then password ok you can see that we are getting both login successful and login field because we have not returned from here when we are login uh, using login function print login successful and then return from here that's it now, uh, now let's try rerunning this ok 2 and then you can see that login successful so yeah guys that's all for this video now let's see you next time